<clears throat> God damn it, I fucked it up. Hey guys, how old are you here from uh, the one and only Technically God Films? I mean, the best absolute channel on fucking YouTube right now. What are we at? Seven subscribers? One that may listen to me? One, uh, Another one that may? me. Most, mostly people that I know. Huh? Yeah? 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 Oh god, oh god, here, here we go, here we go. So it is uh, Friday, May 29th. So, I uh, have to explain what fucking happened with my other videos. Well, first off, last week I did not... <laughs> Sorry, my computer's doing that thing. Oh, fuck off, fuck off. There we go. Okay, so anyways, uh, I was doing... The podcast last week and uh, I didn't upload it and I don't think it was that great of a podcast so I don't, I don't know I just decided you know what fuck it don't upload it and uh, plus I didn't have a great week so I was just like ah fuck it as well so yeah I'm sorry uh, <laughs> I tried doing the podcast I was gonna make it 14.5 and uh, I think by naming it 14.5 it fucked the file when I saved it and then I took it to my other computer because for some reason I do it. I'm, I do the podcast on my shitty computer, and then I move it over to uh, my good computer, and uh, I do the editing and stuff like that. Sorry, it, uh, it's uh, I'm hearing things outside. So uh, when I did that, I brought it over to that new computer, and the file went and open, and then it was all fucked up, and I was just like. Ugh. I'm just like, Argh. and I just, I gave up. I was, I, I was pissed off. So, uh, this week uh, I made some goals for myself, and uh, you know what? It uh, didn't really turn out how I expected that much. Um, so drawing wise, I got drawing in on. I got drawing in on uh, Tuesday and Wednesday, and uh, when. Wednesday was really just, uh, uh, you know that drawing that I've been talking about, the one that I've been just doing over and over, and I was doing for time at a point, but I decided just to uh, do it, just to do it. Can I get that muscle memory? Oh, I thought the fucking audacity crashed. There are fucking people doing things outside, and it's freaking me out. So, uh, Thursday rolls around, and, uh, it was just a fucking busy-ass day, and, uh, I had to get ready for inspection, so I earned a uniform, and honestly, that, that just took a fucking chunk out of my day, but I did do, uh, no, I didn't do, oh, I also had fucking duty, so, what happened with me, uh, Thursday was, so, 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 duty is what you would call, it's like, it's like taking turns to do, do uh, like, to watch something. So, for, for example, like, I guess, like, let's say, like, your, 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 uh, the office you worked at had a front desk. And, uh, a certain, like, every single day, like, a certain group of people would, uh, watch, like, do, do the front desk, like, duty of, like, greeting custo customers and helping people and stuff like that and answering phones and shit like that and uh that's all they did like they uh they went to work and then they also spent their off time doing that as well so that's 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 kind of like duty we, we stand like some they sort of like watch and uh clean and then uh and then uh if we were needed at the office we come back to the office i guess but but the, there's also this other thing called the duty driver, and uh, what he does uh, is he does this thing where he I can't fucking speak right now, where he take like picks up people that needs to be take like unofficial like military business and shit like that. So uh, I wasn't the I wasn't the duty driver; it was somebody else. But guess what? That somebody else was in the class. So guess who uh, came came and got me? So I ended up going like having to go to LA, which is like 
maybe an hour and a half drive. And, uh, I went there, can't, uh, fucking, uh, oh my goodness. I went there, got, got to the airport, picked up the people, picked up the people that were actually in, like, my, uh, so, like, in my work, like, I, I picked up, like, my boss and my, like, assistant boss. There, there, there's a lot, there, yeah, sorry. But it, it, it gets confusing. So um, I picked them up, and then uh, like our, our head boss goes like, let's go to this place called uh, Apple Pan. And it was amazing. It was like the best burger I ever tasted. It was it was like a whole, like a, a really like old fashioned, like uh, I would, I guess a old fashioned burger place. Like you walk in and you see the kitchen in front of you and you see them like chopping the, like the fresh cabbage pickles making the meat like do, doing all this stuff right in front of you making the fries in front of you and everything like that you can see in the background that they have like home baked pies just like sitting in racks like cooling off and it's just like wow this place is like legit and they only accepted cash and they uh, had fucking cash registers that were probably from like 1947 when they opened and uh, they've been open ever since. So it was a pretty cool place. And uh, best burger I think I have ever had. And uh, honestly, if I had to drive an hour and a half for a burger, I probably would go to that place. Because it was uh, actually that that good. It was it was pretty damn good. Um, so, and then I came back. This is explaining. This, this story, I go like, why am I telling this story? I go like, oh yeah, I'm explaining why I didn't have time to service day to do fucking anything. Uh, I came back and uh, I started doing like I went I went to back to my regular job, which was uh, planning and estimating for uh, a project that we're doing, and planning and estimating. It's it, it, it's exactly what you're. You, you, it kind of sounds like you're you're planning for this uh, project, so you're doing like all this fucking like paperwork like how much material you need for this and like for this this portion of the project and it's it's just a lot of tedious work but anyways so i did that until like 4 30 no i didn't we, we went longer that day because i got like oh we're, we're behind so we go i i went until like 4 50 and then i had to go to that what's called a muster is where you group up at a certain time to uh, do like a roll call or some shit like that. So um, we mustered at 17 or uh, 5 o'clock, yes. So 5 o'clock, got, got there, uh, and uh, I'm, I'm in there, and uh, they, go like, they go like, oh, you know what, there's this one guy, he didn't show up for his watch. Uh, would anybody that's uh, would anybody like to take his watch? Well, uh, we'll we'll make it up for you. And I go like, fuck it, fine. And I go, like, and when it was described to me, I thought I was getting a good deal because they made it sound like, oh yeah, he he's coming to watch, but he's just late. He's changing a tire right now. Yeah, motherfucker never showed up. <laughs> but I was so pissed. So I ended up like from. That seventeen hundred mustard. I ended up staying until fucking uh, twenty hundred, which is eight o'clock. Yeah, five to eight o'clock. That's a fucking long time. No, it's not. It wasn't eight. It was eight. Yeah, it was eight. I'm sorry. So I stayed fucking that long because we had the do colors, which is uh, ceremoniously taking down the the ensign or the national flag of America, the United States. Uh, like so uh we took the, uh, took down that and then uh finally I was done and then I <laughs> went back to my room and I go like need the fucking like relax maybe for like 30 fucking minutes and then I started right on like ironing and my uniform hopped in the shower hopped out of the shower shined my shoes and uh ironed my uniform a little bit more and then I didn't eat anything that night because I was just like, oh, we have uh, weigh-ins tomorrow, so I eat. That was awesome, right? So, um, after that, we 
not me, me in general, I went, went to sleep, and then I woke up the next day, which was Friday, and, uh, which, which is today, and it was another kind of busy day, and then, uh, came in the evening, I, uh, oh, I'm doing what I'm doing now, well, came in the evening what I'm doing, what I'm doing now, uh, I am house-sitting for, uh, one of my friends, and I'm here with the wonderful Mia, she's a dog, and Molly, so, uh, guest stars on, on the, on podcast 14.52, three. Is it three? Five, five point three? I think I named this fourteen point something something. Uh, okay. So anyways, I uh to sum things up, uh busy week, busy week. I didn't have a lot of time to do things, but uh honestly I've been listening to a uh a podcast, I guess to say. Not a podcast, a uh they had these uh drawing videos. His name is Syrica, Syrica, and uh, he's he does like uh, drawing drawing tutorials and stuff like that. But uh, I think I find more of his like uh, Q and A things and more of his like I don't really like watch him as because his videos are fucking long. But uh, I listen to him at work while I'm uh, planning and estimating. Uh, so. And I've been, like, getting, like, weird looks as, like, they come over to my table, and they see that this video is fucking playing on my tablet, and then they go, like, are you watching this video? And I go, like, oh, I'm just listening to it as I work. So, that, that's why I've been fucking doing it. All week. And, uh, like, some of the things, because, like, as, as you're working, you, like, tune in and out, and out, and out, and things. But uh, a lot of, uh, what he had to say was, like, Pretty much a lot of people were like, how do I get good at this? How do I get good at this? And uh, he was saying just, you need to put the time into it. You need to put the time, like an hour a day of uh, drawing. And um, honestly, I, ha I I don't have an hour a day, to be perfectly honest. Uh, I get really fucking busy sometimes. And uh, honestly, when you come home after being busy, it's just fucking shitty. So, And I don't want to make this sound like I'm fucking giving myself so many excuses. Uh, yeah, I am making too many excuses, but uh, uh, life happens when you're in the military, so uh, it's not all like free time and sunshine and rainbows. But anyways, uh, hopefully once this p uh, peening gets done, uh, it'll lighten up the load. But anyways, uh, he was talking about putting time into uh, uh, like working on something like it. Like drawing from like from real life and everything like that. Like deciding like one day you're gonna do this, one day you're gonna do this, one day you're gonna do this, and uh, not so much like you're you're practicing because it's more it's like a you shouldn't be afraid to uh, draw because you're afraid of failing. You should be trying to draw and then learning from your mistakes and uh he was also talking a lot about like what he felt was natural talent and uh he he had a lot of uh i'll have to say on that subject because he was saying like uh he he said for example music and art are kind of the same th are are same in the aspects that you need to put a lot of hard work into them so for 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 him at least for uh, for art and uh, he was he was wondering like uh, is, is there like like people having like natural talent and stuff like that? And uh, he goes to he goes on to saying that pretty much comparing like art and music like he goes like well uh, when 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 someone's like talking to a kid about like doing like music and stuff like that, he goes like so you want to learn how to play the piano? Are you sure because it's going to take a lot of hard and time-consuming work to fucking play the piano, right? And, uh, but, uh, when you go to the art side, and it should be the same way, because you're putting effort into, like, learning, like, different, like, 
how they're drawn, stuff like that. Uh, he, he said like that 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 should be like the same asset back like, between two like the two like you need to put like work into it. But no, people are just on the opposite end where it's just like, well, you have you have to be naturally gifted to do art. So, and uh, he, he's saying it's n not the case, and uh, you can start art whenever you fucking want. So, start start drawing and doing all that stuff. So, uh, he's a pretty cool guy. So. Uh, uh, he, he had one one thing that he said that uh, kind of also stuck with me that I'm blanking on right now for some reason. I don't know. I don't know why. I think it was on uh, the same subject of what I was talking about. But I can't for the life of me fucking think of it. Oh, fuck no, computer. <laughs> My computer wants to restart. It fucking updated, updated itself. Like, uh, for like the longest time as I booted it up. So I don't know what the fuck's wrong with it. Piece of shit. So, yeah. I'm so using the fucking shitty computer. I don't know why. Um. Fuck, what was I gonna say about the. About him? Uh, he was saying, like, putting time into it, and he said it usually takes, like, three years to become a really good, uh, artist. At his level, he was he has a videos on, uh, on, like, how to get into the professional field, like, not really how to, but, like, what, what skills you would need, he, th he thinks, in his mind, if you wanted to get into the professional field, and he gives some tips and stuff like that. And uh, it's, that that was that was pretty interesting, and I would probably want to watch watch him again, uh, watch that video again, not watch him again. Oh, oh, oh. yay! Oh, exciting. Um, hmm. so I'm house watching all this week, I guess, and uh, I'm probably gonna draw. Not tonight, not tonight. I'm gonna relax and play some video games with my new. New, 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 new things. Uh, I have a new keyboard for my laptop. <laughs> I have a new mouse, and uh, they're both gaming mouse, my, m a mouse and a laptop, and they are fucking awesome. And I love them right now, and to be perfectly honest, I spent a fuck ton on them. And uh, I had a gift card, and I got like, oh, a $50 gift card. Well, I'll just use this. It would have. I I still spent 180 on all this shit, and uh, what do you call it? And uh, on a on a on a mouse and a key, pretty expensive keyboard, and uh, it's still still 180. Yeah, so whatever 180 plus 50, yeah, 50 bucks, save me from going over like 200 fucking dollars. So, but uh, I guess I should get into a little bit more. On uh, this, on what I'm gonna be doing this, well, maybe over the next couple of weeks or so. So I was thinking, I really need a. I think I'm really gonna get a. Uh, a, oh my God, I'm gonna get a uh, website. So uh, tgf. Uh, dot com or whatever, or some some shit like that, and uh, I'm probably gonna. Either get on Squarespace or Squarespace, or get a URL and then find some way of getting getting hosted or something like that. And uh, I'm planning on doing that soon-ish, maybe. I'm not sure. Uh, so maybe in the next coming weeks, getting a, a website up and running. So uh, that would be cool, and I hope I'm I'm hoping that I'll kick my butt a little more, a bit more into gear and uh, stuff like that. Uh, also. Wanted to talk about uh, I ha I do have a DeviantArt page. It's uh, El Wolfinator, and uh, I have yet to post fucking anything on it. And uh, I think I'm gonna actually start posting on that pretty soon. I may post some uh, other drawings that I did, but uh, I don't know because I I, I hear from Cyr Cyrutha, uh, uh, I don't know why I want to say Cyrutha assassin, uh, that he. Uh, I mean, all I do is this. I do a lot of uh, what you would call copying uh, down. 
what do you call it? Copying down? That's a fucking term. What the fuck am I trying to express? I do a lot of uh, copying work of uh, other people. Like, I go like, wow, that's a cool piece of art. And then I just draw it. So, like, I see a cool, like, anime. And I go like, oh, I want to draw this character. And I draw that, ca draw that character. But I don't draw it, like, in my own way. I just draw it as I see it on the, on the page. And, I mean, uh, maybe I should branch out and try to do that. And that would be good. Hopefully. Maybe. I don't know. We'll find out. So, uh, I don't know about posting, because I don't want to, like, post and, like, and have someone go, like, well, you're stealing that, or something like that. I don't think someone would fucking say that. I'm just, like, here, here's here's my work and how I've been, oh, God, I farted, and how I've been doing, and I farted again. So, mm, mm. and now it stinks, and now it stinks. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I talked about... Yeah, so I, I'll probably be posting some more stuff in the coming weeks on DeviantArt. I'll let you know on uh, both the channel and uh, on this. And on Twitter? We have we have a Twitter. Uh, t technically odd films. Yeah, we have a Twitter. Uh, we also have a fucking Facebook. So, oh god. <laughs> But anyways, um, oh, videos, video-wise for this channel. So, uh, I know the only things I've been doing is just fucking, uh, just this podcast. And it's nice, actually, to just to do a podcast and get some content out there. So, uh, these will c continue throughout the weeks. And, uh, also what will continue, well, what will happen is I'm planning on doing, like, some sort of, uh, review with, uh, uh, the the Oscars for this last year, uh, for best animated picture, there were uh, two mu movies. The one that won was uh, Big Hero Six, and uh, the other one that I th I thought that should have won was uh, The Tale of uh, Princess uh, Kaguya, and uh, uh, it's a not a Hayao Miyazaki movie. It's a Studio Ghibli movie done by uh, one of the co-founders of Studio Ghibli, and. Uh, uh, he did, his only other work, I think, was the Grave of the Fireflies. I think I'm pronouncing, I think I'm saying that, that title right. I'm sorry if I'm not. Uh, but, uh, yeah, it's, it's a, it's a very beautiful, like, arts, I would say artsy movie, like, beautiful animation-wise. Yeah, uh, not something that you would see, uh, see, like, lately, especially with, uh, 3D. Like uh, I, like I felt Big Hero Six was very a lot more uh, going for realism, and not really realism, but like it felt more like real, yeah, it's realism. And uh, the Tale of Princess Kaguya was uh, it was like old school like two D animation, and I was like very impressed with it, and the colors and what they did with it, and uh, it also had a lot of uh. The disc had a lot of what you would call... I, I just got really fucking close to my laptop. Had a lot of uh, content for ex extra content. What the fuck is that? Uh, special features. There we go. And uh, it talked about him making the movie. And it was... It was... It was like watching... Like, I watched the movie and I watched that. And that was like... It, it, even as good because it was just yeah and then I go to Big Hero 6 and I go like oh I'll get the Blu-ray maybe they'll have something like that and it was like short little clip like of yeah and this is the movie blah 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 done next blah 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 done blah 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 done I don't like it that much and I was going like oh maybe they'll have a commentary that would be really cool because I love uh audio commentaries and stuff like that and uh no 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 also it was a Shorter movie than I expected, Big Hero Six, but, uh, uh, but to continue on the subject, I uh, why the compare the two and uh, say which one should have won, and uh, I don't want to give a like bias between. Like, I I want to say like what 
I, I want to give it a fair thing, so we'll we'll see how this uh, review goes, and maybe I'll do some more with that. So, uh, yeah, it's gonna be be uh, the end of another week, and uh, I'm gonna probably draw a lot tomorrow and uh, the next day. So I'm gonna get the drawing in this uh, this weekend. Maybe it's not as much as I wanted to, but uh, I'll get it in. But uh, I'll probably get the drawing in, and then I'll probably write some. Because yeah, I've been neglecting that with uh, my new, with this awesome new keyboard. It's so cool. It glows! So, uh, I'll be doing that. So, yeah. Um, so, I guess I will post this, this Friday, and then... I don't know. Should I start doing these Friday or keep doing them Monday? I think I'll keep doing them Monday. And I'll tell you how this weekend went. Monday or Tuesday, I'll fucking post this. Uh, it would actually be nice to start doing these on Tuesday and posting them on the fucking day. So I don't fucking forget, right? But, uh, yeah. I think I'll do that maybe from now on. But anyways, uh, thank you for whoever is uh, supporting me on YouTube, and uh, thank you for uh, listening to this wonderful, maybe shitty podcast. I think I'm getting better. This one, this one felt like real, felt a lot better compared to uh, some other ones. So uh, I hope you enjoyed this. We'll be doing more, and uh, yeah, El Wolfinator out in this I swear the fucking god computer if you fucking freeze me and 